How much are your um, DVD players? I was thinking like 30. Okay. 20? Let's Make me offer. <laughs> Checking the sold comps real quick on eBay. Looks like it goes for about $50. Kind of keep looking through this sale here. They have a lot of toys. I wish I was more knowledgeable on toys, but you know, it just takes more practice. So I'm kind of looking, but I feel like I should have checked or, you know, try to comp some stuff on eBay a little bit more. What do you think about it? Okay. It's like a media streamer, but an Apple, an Apple one. It, it goes for like 50. Okay. But I don't, I don't think toys are too much to get into it. I'm thinking 15. It's not fair. Ask her if it works first. Does this Apple TV thing work over here or? It should. I okay. can get my husband. Yeah, actually, we used it on our old TV. We haven't used it in a long time. Gotcha. Okay. Um, we bought the newer version yeah. of it, but okay. I can. No, that's what I, just, I was just curious. Sure. Gotcha. Okay. Many details that go with it. Yeah, that's the remote that goes with it. Okay. Gotcha. Would you, would you do 15 on it? Yeah, we can do 15. Okay. Let me just clarify what No him. problem. I ask him. No, no worries. It's the first generation. Okay. It's the first generation. I just reset all the settings. Yeah. It, uh, okay. Um, last night. Sure. It's, it still worked. Okay. Right in, so. Cool. All right. I was just curious. Have you ever used an Apple TV before? Uh, my friend had one. I mean, we have we have Apple stuff. You, you'll use you know, that. So. Yeah. And then yeah. as soon as you get used to that, you'd be like, all right, I want the next level. Yeah. That's how right. we were. We wanted the next gen. Yeah. So. I hear you. I just got her an Apple Watch and she loves that. So yeah. it's just like. And if you haven't, I don't know if the first gen does it, but the newer ones, you can even like control the remote from your phone and oh, stuff. Oh, cool. It has it yeah, all hooked together. You can do it from your phone, can control that one, set the setup. Okay, cool. So. Well, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank all you. All right, guys, have a great day. You too. It's so funny when you watch footage back, you're like, oh man, I should have checked that. But that keyboard back there, I probably should have checked that because I've sold keyboards before and you know they go for a decent amount of money depending. I think sometimes maybe I just get nervous because things are big, so they're gonna be a little bit more to ship. So I probably get nervous about that. That's why I didn't look at it. But keep your eye out for keyboards because they do go for some money, especially on certain models. Hiya. Morning. <laughs> So I see this receiver over here, um, and a lot of times I look for electronics. You guys know that I look for like the DVD, VHS players, things like that. But this is a receiver. Um, it's a Pioneer receiver, so I'm going to look it up on eBay right here. I'm going to check some comps, and it's comping out really well. It's going for like over a couple hundred dollars. So I was like, okay, um, this looks interesting. Now, I don't know if it works or anything, but I'm like, all right, well, this could be you know a possibility. So I'm looking at it. Trying to see if there is a remote control that goes with it. I don't see one there, so I want to check the back, make sure the power cord is in there. Okay, look, yep, yeah, power cord's there. Then to the left of the receiver, I head over and I see a VHS player there, so I'm going to look that up real quick. And as you guys can see there on the sold listings, it's going for about 50 bucks or so, so that's pretty good comps for that, depending how much that they want for it. And then I see this Singer sewing machine right here. They want $30 for it, but it's in the original, you know, box right there. So I'm like, okay, that looks pretty cool. So I want to open it up. And it looks like on the inside, it's still in the original packaging. Um, I should have looked this up. I don't know why I did it. Maybe I just saw the $30 price tag and I was like, oh, it's kind of a lot to get into, but some of these sewing machines can go for a lot of money. How much are your um, DVD players? DVD players, Carl? 
You know, the top one, the BBB, the top one doesn't, I don't have a cord for it. Okay. I mean, so you might have to try and find it. How about this one? Um, Ten dollars. Okay, how much is, how much for this over here? I was thinking like 30. Okay. 20? That's Make me off it. It would have, I, don't I don't really know what they're worth. Yeah, no I hear idea. you. Well, I don't know if it works or not, and it's older, so I don't know. I'll think about it on I'm that on one. Ten. All right, I'll think about it. Okay. Okay. Think about it. How about the the DVD player? <sighs> I'll think about that one too. Okay. All right. Yeah. Whatever. Well, okay, I appreciate it. Sure. Do you see anything, Stace? Uh, there's no like it. Okay. All right. I was thinking about a DVD a DVD player. You don't, have, you don't have the uh, remote controller or anything for it? No. no. Okay. Would you do uh, 15 for both? 10 and 5? How about 20 for both? Well, you said 10 for this. I was thinking 5 for that. Because there's, there's no controller, so I don't... 15 for both sounds great. Alright, let's do it. Do you have any change? I do. Like, no. like for like a hundred? Oh, no, I don't really have no. change okay. for hundred. Thought I'd ask. Okay, no, I appreciate it. Because those are my last fives. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, well, thank you. I sure. appreciate it. All right, thanks so much. All right, you have a great day. Man, I think it's heavy. So if you guys see anything as we're going through these garage sales that I missed, please let me know in a comment down below because I always love learning about different things. So I'm sure there's a lot of things that I missed that I have no idea about. So like I said, if you guys see anything, please let me know. Now I probably should have looked at this Cybershot game right here. It kind of reminded me of that game Crossfire, you know, back in the early 90s, late 80s. I don't know if you guys remember that, but you put the little marbles in the gun and you like shot it out of the gun onto these like spinning discs that were on the table. And then you had to shoot the discs over into your opponent's side. It's a pretty sweet game. I am not, no. It was for my mom. Mm -hmm. Where are we going to put the pillows? So as I'm over here on this table, I see some perfume. Now, I'm not sure if they're vintage perfumes, but vintage perfumes can go for a lot of money. So I'm looking at this one, like, oh, I'm not really sure. Then I see like this gift box set over here. So I decided to look it up. I get the eBay app out. I used the scanner and I scanned the box, but it wasn't really going for that much. So I had to leave it. You can look at the bottom. It's just an overhaul not long ago and I haven't used it, but I just... Will you take 12? Uh, not today. So Stacey's over here, she's going to look through these quilts real quick. Always keep an eye out for quilts. Quilts can be worth so much money, it's so surprising, especially the ones that are hand quilted. So you know, not the ones that are done by machines, but the ones that are actually hand quilted, those can be worth a lot of money.